An epic battle for the lead between Denny Hamlin and Joey Logano. And today, honestly, Harrison Burton has been has been very impressive today. He's been a top five for most of the race. I'm very impressed with him. Maybe he could pull off an upset and get his first career win. He could be a he could be a new different driver to get their first career win in Daytona. Wow. The last the last driver who did the act was Eric Jones. Oh no 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 no. The last driver to win the Coca Cola six Ah my mistake guys. I keep mixing up between the Coke Zero 400 and the Coca-Cola 600. Yeah, anyways, last driver to get their first career win at Daytona for for the regular season finale was William Byron. And who knows, maybe today Harrison Burton can make his own history and give the Wood Brothers Racing their 100th career win. Their last win was with Ryan Blaney when he was with the 21 team. Now he's with Team Penske. Wow, this could be like this could be like a fairy tale upset for or for the twenty one team. Honestly, he is very impressive today. Wow. There's Daniel Hamrick in the sixteen. Normally AJ Allmendinger would be behind the wheel, but they are sharing the rides with Noah Gregson who's driving the sixty two today. And Daniel Hamrick who's in the race today. Wow. But so far, today's race has been interesting. It wouldn't have been better if we raced yesterday, but but there was a rain delay, so it was postponed until uh, till 10 a.m. this morning. But so far, things have been pretty interesting. Wow. I can't wait to see what these guys will do. At the end of stage two, which we got 25 laps to go, there's the 21 of Harrison Burton. Cool looking paint ski that he's driving. Wow, he's looking good. And there's my man Kyle Bush in the 18. He's driving my favorite paint ski, the Interstate Batteries Toyota. He's looking good. Wow, I'm impressed with the 18 as well. Can't wait to see what they can do at the end of stage two. I have to keep my eye on the 18 and the 21. 